it bore the stroke of that which kills and saves it that is the strength in the soul of savitri it is that which is bearing the stroke of that the stroke which kills and saves it kills what opposes its action it saves from all that which will attack it it kills and it saves the problem the issue is that this world looks to be a great prison house entrapped in all kinds of laws and rules and regulations most of them springing up from darkness from ignorance from falsehood we are all trapped in that thing this world is an immense jail the walls of the jail are high the walls of the jail are stony walls rigid solid walls and at the gates of the jail stand stern guards armored guards they will block the road nobody can escape from this jail there are guards there are inquisitions there are tribunals tribunals of darkness and they are present every fair that halls the wheel of life life wants to make progress move forward but death comes and halls the wheel of life but again this there is someone who can stand up and oppose this iron law who can demolish the stone walls of this chain there is an intense flame in someone which will blaze out everything which opposes its will it is savitri's soul and therefore she would not bow down to the decree of darkness dark decree she will dismiss immediately she will stand against that in her there is a strength which does not come from this ordinary weak feeble world it comes from a higher source it is a strength which comes from her transcendental source superhuman strength is there in her and she is conscious of her that the strength will enter into her and remove all these obstacles demolish all these laws what is true what is eternal what is divine it is that which it will promote which it will carry forward in spite of these gas inquisitions tribunals she will assert herself all along it avails nothing this human strength even if savitri wants to have that human strength what can it achieve it avails nothing she has savitri has a work to do here and she cannot depend upon human help she has to get the help directly 
from her soul. She has a word to speak. She has to complete the writing or the story of her soul. And Savitri cannot stop that. She has to move forward. It is on the basis of the strength which is within her. She has to move forward. It is that which will give her the true power of inspiration, the word to write the story of her soul. There is a force in her which has been tolling since the beginning of this creation, since the beginning of this mortal world, since the beginning of the earth. There is a source in her which is tolling and asserting itself all along. And it is that story Savitri has to write. She has to go within to discover her strength. She has to find her soul and see that in that soul is present the divine force herself in it. She has to invoke and bring down this force, the divine force, the Shakti in her soul. How is Savitri going to do that? To bring down the divine force in her soul. How is she going to do that? It can be by prayer. It can be by kind of a master act. It can be by some kind of a powerful king idea that she can bring down the transcendental force in her soul. With that force, then Savitri will be able to remove the obstacles which stand in the way. It is that strength, it bore the strength, it bore the stroke of that which kills and saves. Thank you.